So we just finished this project a couple days ago and I want to do a quick walkthrough of it. This brick patio was existing. These are actual natural clay brick pavers, uh, not pavers, they are clay bricks. And they were all lopsided and uneven. The ground was heaving, there was dirt in between the joints, lots of weeds, tree roots uh, were growing up and it was just completely unlevel. So we came in and put a four inch compacted crushed aggregate stone base. Uh, we set it on a one inch layer of granite M10 bedding sand. We have an engineered plastic edge restraint along this left hand side. And the reason I'm not pointing these things out is because I'm holding an umbrella. It is pouring rain today. So sorry about that. Uh, we laid this in a running bond pattern going left to right. We've lined everything up with the concrete on this side. It was completely uneven when we got started. We have filled in between the joints with a polymer joint sand. We put in a brand new lawn back here. This is Discovery Bermuda Sod. It is a very heavily shade tolerant uh, form of Bermuda. We installed new black mulch. There are seven Encore uh, Autumn Fire Azaleas that will bloom multiple times per year. At the left and right side, we wanted to create a focal point sort of to anchor this entrance. So these are two large red rhododendrons. Coming down, there's a new stair that we relocated. It was originally, uh, I'm gonna point with my foot here, it was originally in this area and we moved it to the left to bump out around this large tree. See, these tree roots, I'm gonna point with my foot again, these tree roots were growing right in here, causing this patio to heave up. So we, reloc we moved it to the left, gave it a little more curve, and then move this stair over. This area down below was a mess. It was just all uneven. It did not line up with those existing gray brick stairs. We installed this additional section of granite stone retaining wall. Um, there's a concrete top on it sort of matches the architecture that's already here. If we had gone with a cap in this area it would not have matched what is existing and there's about 60 feet of granite wall that's already existing in this area so we just extended on about uh, nine more feet in this area. So in any case, that is our brick paver project with some new planting, some new mulch, and shade tolerant Discovery Bermuda sod. Great ideas for your next project. And leave your comments below and be sure to subscribe. Thank you.